People are always asking me how close these receivers will run after we recut the threads in them. And it's actually a pretty hard thing to say. I usually tell people they're pretty damn close. Um, the shaft itself has usually got about a quarter thou of play in it. And basically the shaft runs on sort of an oil bearing inside the receiver. So they're, you know, no matter how tight you get it, it's always got a little bit of play and they're never perfectly straight. And there's also play in the chuck itself. There's probably about a half a thousandth of an inch or a thousandth of an inch of slap at this end. Um, but at this one I actually took it off the tap and screwed it back on and took the mandrel out of the tailstock of the machine and I've just pushed it back in. And this is a one-tenth indicator. It uh, measures in tenths of thousands. One complete revolution is ten thousandths of an inch. And now if we take and turn the receiver and follow the needle, you can see that in one complete turn of the chuck, it's actually moved about two thousandths of an inch at this end. So considering all the slap that's in the machine, in the bar, and then plus the fact that these indicators are only accurate within two tenths, it's running well under two thousandths of an inch at nine inches. So they do come out pretty close, a lot closer than people would think.